name is the legendary DJ Marley Mall. A lot of y'all might know me from Mr. Magic Marley Mall back in the day, but that's not the first time I got on the air at BLS. First time I got on the air and walked in the building at WBLS, it was with Pat Prescott. She was the um, air personality, and she wanted to do like an exercise program around 12 o'clock, so she needed edited versions with no vocals, just instrumentals of songs. And that was my first job at BLS. The first time I heard my name on the radio, Pat Prescott and Francesca Spiro hired me to do stuff back in the day here at BLS. Then I got famous from being on Mr. Magic's show because it was rap music. But you know, when I was doing the regular stuff in the afternoon, I started out in the afternoons. Could you believe that? Then I got with Mr. Magic through Dr. Barb Lee. The rest of that history, are you all ready for that? Because that, that's when it got crazy. The whole Juice Crew derived from the van. The first Juice Crew on the van, since it was the Juice Mobile, it was the Juice Crew. So the first Juice Crew was Mike C, LA Sunshine, Melly Mel, me and Curtis Blow hitting the streets with Mr. Magic in the van. That's the first Juice Crew. The Juice Crew All-Stars consist of Roxanne, Shantae, and so on, so on, so on. That's the All-Stars. But the first Juice Crew was who I mentioned first. Could you imagine that? Now, when I first got with Mr. Magic, I was out there with Bob Lee on the van. We was doing the, um, the, the parties in the street. Now, we'd be rocking the parties. And Mr. Magic would come with his crew. He had a crew before, you know, that was the Juice Crew. He would come with his guys, Melly Mel, and them say, the party's here now. I'm like, bro, bro, we've been rocking the parties all night. The party been here before you got here, so don't act like just because you're here, the party's here. So between all of that, you know, we, we had like a funny relationship because I ain't, I ain't really like dude. You know, when he first asked me could he play my mixes on the, on his show, I was like, no, for like two, three weeks, no, because I don't fuck with you. <laughs> I don't mess with you. So you can't play my mixes. About the third party, he came and heard one of the mixes. He's like, yo, that's fire. I'm, I'm, yo, I'm, I'm, I'm on BLS now. You should let me do it. We got two million listeners. I was like, hmm, that sounds like, sounds like a plan right there. You got two million listeners. In my house, I got zero listeners. So what I'm going to do, I think since I was always practicing radio in my house, I'm going to go on the radio now, now. When I first got to the radio station with Mr. Magic, he, he, he knew from the gate. As soon as I saw the reel to reels on the wall, I ran up, I said, oh, y'all got reels up here? All my mixes are on reel. He's like, oh, okay, that's different for a DJ. So I went to the reel and spooled it right up. He's looking at me like, Man, I never saw a DJ do that before. He told me, once I saw you spool that reel, I knew it had to happen. I needed you here because you, you was very professional and you knew what you was doing. And you know, I gotta say, I'm the first DJ to DJ live on the radio. Nobody was doing that before me and Mr. Magic. I mean, Red Alert and Chuck, they was pre-recorded on Kiss. So they was like a week behind. That's why we was always ahead of them. But I was the first DJ to zigga, zigga, zigga on the radio. Could you imagine that? Could you imagine? And I used the radio stations Equipment. I didn't even bring my own turntables in. I used the big ass turntables they had there and the big mixer. And I'm going zigga, 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 back to the other side of the room, zigga, 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 back to the other side of the room. I was like, hey, the cue was in the speaker, so I didn't even need headphones. It was like incredible for me. So that's the beginning of how I got to BLS and I rocked with Mr. Magic and we became the first rap radio show on commercial radio, Mr. Magic Rap Attack. Bam. 50 years, y'all.